Hey there folks, this is Josh Stony Ridge Farmer. Welcome back to another beautiful day here in the foothills of the Blue Ridge Mountains of North Carolina. Today we're gonna to be having some fun. So we've got Daisy Jr. out and we've got the little Bobcat T595. This is my neighbor's machine. And I asked him, I said, dude, do you mind if I try out the Dan User Intimidator, that big tree puller tree clip? with your machine, with the track machine, instead of using that little skitty bop wheel machine with the old timey lever system. So today we're gonna to be putting the T595 and the Dan user together and we're gonna be cleaning up a bunch of brush back here. So come along, we'll have some fun. I'll show you this machine, show you how it works. And we got a lot of debris and brush to pull up. And we're gonna make a big old burn pile. Awesome, woo! All right, guys, welcome to the Stony Ridge Farm Channel. If this is your first time, please pound the like button, subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you back. So what we've got here is called a Dan User Intimidator. This is a monster of a machine for pulling and clearing and cleaning up brush, pulling fence posts, just gathering up brush and clearing land when it's overgrown. So if we would have had this probably five years ago, when we first started clearing our land, we would have probably been able to clear most of our pastures with this machine right here. So what it does is it just has a clipping action. It grabs and it pulls the tree up. Now I have not used it on a cab model and I haven't used it on a machine as powerful as this Bobcat. So my neighbor assures me, I let him try it out for a couple of days and my neighbor assures me that this thing is an absolute beast. So it's gonna speak for itself pretty much. You can dig up big trees, root balls if you want to, if you can't pull them up. And uh, what we're gonna do is make a big slash pile. I'll show you the area that we're gonna be working with. Good looking Jeep, ain't it? <laughs> Good looking machine. What would you rather have? That machine with the Dan user or the Jeep? Let me know down there <laughs> in the comments section. So what we're gonna be clearing, and this is my buddy's pond area right here. It's a little bit on the windy side, but we're working down in the holler. This here's the holler, and that there's the hill. <laughs> so we're gonna be working down in the holler, and this is what we're pulling up. Scrub brush, that's basically what we call this. Just scrub brush, old pine trees, and everybody's gonna say, there are gonna be some comments here. Wow, those trees could have been used for something. This is overgrowth, this is brush, this is pasture. He wants this to look like that. And in order to do that, we've gotta get rid of this stuff. So we can either take a forestry mulcher through here, take a loader or a bulldozer through here, or we can put the machinery he already has to work. So let's have some fun. I'm gonna set the camera up and I hope it doesn't blow over. This is gonna be just an awesome treat, an awesome treat for me to sit in an air conditioned machine and get some work done. Love doing this kind of stuff. This is my thing, man. Let's have some fun.
All right, <laughs> definitely gonna be some hand work. Ah, look at that pile, holy cow, this is huge, man. What a huge pile. So I told you, right now the camera is right where it was when we got started, and I told you you'd be able to see the pond. We can't already see the pond because I <laughs> built such a brush pile, but check it out. You can see both ponds now. I couldn't even tell there was two ponds before. Uh, all this brush, all this debris is gone. And now you can just back in here with a brush hog and, and brush hog it. Awesome. Uh, my buddy's got some plans. This is a spring fed pond. The spring is right down in there, which I found a wet area and nearly I puckered up. Let's just say that. <laughs> so had a good time today. The Dan User Intimidator is awesome. That Bobcat 595 is awesome. Just had a great day, man. I love sitting in that cab. That comfy air conditioning, 85 degrees. Whew, gotta get me one of those. Thanks a lot, guys. We'll see you next time on the Stony Ridge Farm. All right? Woo! Come on down to the Stony Ridge. Bring your wife and 